Uh, well, I always look for keen chefs that are interested in uh, uh, basically cooking at home. So if they're used to cooking at home, they're obviously going to be uh, keen to cook at work. Um, uh, yeah, good timekeeping is always really good. Uh, presentation. Absolutely. The last thing I want is uh, uh, obviously the first thing I want is them turning up on time. Second, second thing is obviously not watching the clock. So obviously, if they're if they're not keen, they're uh, and they want to keen to come home, they're obviously not enjoying themselves. Um, and we want them to enjoy themselves because obviously that's going to show in what they're doing. Obviously very important, uh, presentation is everything to us. When we get visitors around the kitchen, we want them to look smart, we want them to look clean uh, and obviously part of the team. Protective clothing obviously, uh, so they need to protect themselves. Uh, obviously any accidents at work, if they spill any hot water, obviously this, uh, uh, what we're wearing is uh, designed to, to keep us safe. Um, and obviously uh, non-slip shoes are really important. Uh, aprons, obviously to protect uh, lower parts, um, so yeah. Well absolutely, uh, English is obviously very good for communication, uh, you need to communicate with your team. Uh, also maths, uh, recipes are very important, not so much maybe with the savouries but with when you're working in pastry, uh, uh, ingredients uh, and weighing out ingredients is really really important because obviously you can spend a lot of time uh, making pastry, uh, creme brulees uh, and if the recipes aren't right then obviously you've got to do it all again. And sometimes you have to multiply the recipes. Absolutely, yeah. Uh, and obviously we have recipes for obviously for four and if you times it by a hundred uh, and you do it wrong that's a lot of money down the drain. Very important obviously uh, keeping your knives uh, sharp uh, to do the job properly and um, cut you know as you know yourself cut your uh, cut yourself with a blunt knife, you're going to do more damage to yourself than you are uh, with a sharp knife. Keeping them clean uh, is very important, obviously cross-contamination uh, is uh, uh, obviously something you've got to be aware of all the time. Uh, as well as hygiene and handling them uh, after and before work, uh, you've also got the point about distractions, obviously using sharp knives, using slicers, uh, if you get, the, get your phone going off, uh, then obviously that's going to distract you, may cause an accident, so obviously uh, there's a risk assessment. Working tide is really important, again, you're reducing cross-contamination. Uh, uh, I was always taught at college uh, when you leave a kitchen, you've got to leave it as if uh, there was nobody working in it. Uh, so if you're leaving the kitchen, then leave it nice and tidy. Uh, and it also says a lot about uh, yourself, you're working clean and tidy. Uh, and also you work more efficiently if you're working clean and tidy. Uh, 